First, the Christmas party season is up and running and the NHS has launched a smartphone application that could help you keep track of how much alcohol you're drinking. Carol, the device <laughs> which can help you keep a tally of how many units of alcohol is actually in your drink will also give you personalised feedback on your drinking habits. So does this sound like a good idea for those party goers amongst us? Yeah. Well, yes, it does. Come on, no, Why? if you... Why? Because, Why? right, speaking as a person... Who, all right. Um, speaking as a person that gets drunk probably once or twice a year at the most... <laughs> yes, I do! No, you know you I don't up drink. Last I did. But you know what? If I'd known what perhaps poisons I was putting in my body, I probably wouldn't have gone so far, to you be honest. You didn't know what day it was. Yeah, I know what poison. Exactly. Oh, you're getting a little phone guy out when you're totally... <laughs> I mean, it's just not I mean, realistic. It's a good idea. No, I do, and I think especially you two, especially you, madam. Why especially me? <laughs> Why especially Denise? No, well. I just think that, I mean, A, I can't believe it, because I'm going to talk about that in a minute, what exactly units is. Mm. I just think that those people who go out for a proper drink at Christmas time or whatever are not going to be able to see the blooming <laughs> thing, let alone press the, press the things about, into it's it. It's about looking after yourself. We can all go out and have a good time and get a little bit tipsy and have, and, uh, you know, and have fun. But, you know, the damage you're doing to yourself, you see it, maybe if you saw it, how many units you're putting in, Zoe, equals what, health-wise, you we, wouldn't do it. We know, how, we know how dangerous it is. We know what the allowed limit is. You don't, you know, can you just imagine I how don't boring going out and try and get is. off with someone and then go, just a minute, just check my alcohol count. <laughs> <laughs> Exactly. That's, probably, that's probably why you haven't had any for six months. Exactly <laughs> what difference is it going to make? That's what I'd like to know. You know, no, all right, so me. you've got a little thing that tells you how many units you're drinking. Who's going to take any notice of it? Even if you can be bothered to download the application, put it in your phone, stay sober enough to actually enter anything into <laughs> it. I mean, who cares? Stop bossing me about. Stop telling me that I should... I know yeah. what's in alcohol. I know it's bad for you, but... I like it! Yay! Yay! You sound like a drunken old lush. No! I like it! I not actually. Look, you know as well as I do that I'm I'm more of a lightweight even yeah. than you. I have or to Jane. Say, yeah, I have to say, Carol uh, does get drunk very quickly. She doesn't drunk, drink an awful lot. I don't. And uh, so I have to stand up for my mate here. Thank uh, you, Jane. Yes, I am doing, because she doesn't. She just gets drunk really quickly. Yeah. She's a very cheap date. She I is. Yeah. <laughs> you are she's a little, yeah. very early night. She's, she's little and often. Yes. Is, is, is Carol. Yeah. As you well know. But uh, I, I get a bit confused with, with how many units. Is it a big glass of wine? How many units is a big glass of wine? Is it a pint of bitter? Is it half a lag? Can I, I, don't do, know. Can yes, I just do please a tell me? Because I'm right. confused. Okay. Oh, here we go. I haven't got me nana specs. Sorry about this. Right. Okay. What would you say? is in a large glass of wine. Two units. Carol? It depends on the oh, alcohol shut up. Zoe? volume of the wine. If it's 14.5%, it will be three. Just uh, generally. Three Zoe, what maybe would you say? Three. Three. Right. It's three units. Is right. it? It's three units. So, that ha so how many of that would well, we be allowed a, a week then? Well, a standard glass of wine is two units. What's okay? a standard glass? Bigger than this? Glass, well, no, you know mils. what I mean. But that As means to two fifty mils. But that means if I was to have, say, the, the allowed allowance, that's four glasses of wine in a whole week. A week. That's me before I've left the kitchen, before I've even gone out. <laughs> before I've gone out. <laughs> but this is surprising. In a pint of cider, pint of strong cider, four point seven units. Really? Yep. Ooh. A gin and tonic's all right, though, so we can have 25 of them, 1.5. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously, though, that's though. a single gin. That's a single gin. Yeah, so, yeah. What, so, gin. so what you're saying is you would take absolutely no notice of this, you will carry on drinking yourself no. into the grave, and you don't care. No, I'm not drinking myself into the grave. I feel better when I've had a little drink. <laughs> contrary, contrary to... Po honestly, I feel worse when I don't have a drink. Contrary to popular opinion... I don't go out on the lash all the time. Mm -hmm. I just prefer... Do you know what AA <laughs> says, Zoe Tyler? What? Right. AA. AA says that when you're an alcoholic... Is that, hang on, is that the you... breakdown service? The breakdown <laughs> service, that's right. <laughs> um, so. As opposed to the RAC where you do a bit of Shakespeare. Um, <laughs> but uh, yeah. they say, they say <laughs> that, that when you have a problem, it's when you become powerless over alcohol. So it doesn't actually matter whether you do that seven days a week or when you do it like you did the other week, where before the mozzarella and bu the buffalo mozzarella, you couldn't talk. So therefore, that's still, that's still apparently having a problem like you say me and Carol have. Well, do you know, 
Sorry, love. Oh, go on. I'm just saying, we, we sound like we've been on the lash already. Have you heard us? We're like fishwives yeah, arguing about... We do, a, you know, we haven't. You know, but I, I do like a nice glass of wine. And I don't so do, do it... I? I, yeah, you know, I don't do it very often. So I, I wouldn't want to have... I think it's so rude also when people take out a phone in company and start doing that all the time. Even if so, you're doing that too, yeah, to for, see, you, for the good yeah. of your own health. And what happens when you're in a restaurant and somebody just tops you up? It's, it's a bit difficult to yeah, find out. Yeah, how are that. you going to keep track of it? I, I'm all for low alcohol um, booze. But the trouble is, it doesn't taste of booze. It just tastes of pop. And I don't want to drink pop. If I want to drink pop, I drink Coca-Cola and lemonade. That's why I get drunk, because I like the taste of booze. <laughs> <laughs> but it's, booze. It, is, it is also to do with the little sort of buzzy feeling that you get. I just wish that we mm. could stop there, don't you? But sa sadly, we can't, and we're too old to change.